for the Wisconsin Coalition for Gun Safety says Governor Walker is taking the wrong approach in tackling school safety. He introduced a package of legislation last week in the aftermath of the shooting in Parkland, Florida. Our Rose Schmidt is here to tell us why gun control advocates are calling his plan inadequate. Rose? Yeah, that's right. They say that they want more robust gun safety legislation. The governor wants to create a school safety grant program to make security improvements, add training opportunities, and school resource officers. But at a news conference today, gun safety advocates said Walker's proposal doesn't address prevention of gun violence in schools. They're calling for universal background checks and exceeding school revenue limits. Governor Walker toured an elementary school near La Crosse today. It's a school he says that implements his goals for school safety. Every student, every teacher, uh, every parent, every staff member, everyone who visits our schools here and across the state should feel absolutely uh, safe. During Governor Walker's tenure, we have had countless shootings, some tragedies right here in Wisconsin that we believe could have been prevented with better, stronger gun safety rules. The state Senate plans to pass its own school safety measures this week. The Assembly and Senate must pass identical bills before they'd head to Governor Walker's desk for approval. Other proposals from the governor would require mandatory reporting for threats of school violence and requiring all schools to have a school safety plan. The Assembly Education Committee will hear from the public tomorrow on the governor's bills, and they're expected to approve them on Thursday. We'll continue to follow it. Thanks, Rose. Uh,